<laughs> Sorry, I, I, I realised I hadn't turned my mic, put my mic down there, so you probably didn't hear me. So yeah, hello guys, and welcome to my 2B2T exploration video. Uh, in today's video, we're just going to continue exploring 2B2T. I just had to turn off the chat there, because, uh, yeah, don't want to get banned for someone saying the N-word. And, uh, yeah, like, since I'm growing a little bit, like, I'm more likely to get, you know, viewed off of, like, YouTube. So, yeah, I need to start turning, like, the chat off. Off. Even though I have been turning it off, but I need to make sure it's turned off now because uh, they're more likely to see my videos, which isn't good. Like YouTube uh, bans you for quite a lot nowadays. So yeah. Oh yeah. Someone asked uh, what a texture pack I'm using for the green enchantments. Uh, it's not a texture pack, I'm using the impact client. Uh, basically it's just a hack client I use and uh, you can change the enchantment colours. It's free so yeah you can get it yourself. Is this a big island or just a, a weird diagonal one? <laughs> Bunny rabbits, of course. Goddamn rabbits. I don't like rabbits. They're annoying because they have so much health and they don't die when you hit them in this game. Do, 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 do. I want this coal. Oh yeah, I'm really close to 50 subscribers now. I'm actually surprised. Like, I've a uh, like. I know uh, I've made a lot of videos, but I'm surprised I've like grown this fast. I'm happy about it. It means uh, my con people enjoy my content, and I couldn't be happier about that. Like, I love I love like uh, making videos, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep making videos. I've noticed that uh, my videos are also getting a, a lot more views now. That's that I'm really happy about. I'm actually so glad that I'm actually getting views now, because I actually thought that no one wanted to view my videos, and I felt felt pretty sad about it. But I kept making videos because, like I did say, I'm gonna keep making videos for at least a few years, and uh, I'll see where it goes from there. If it uh, like in those few years, say I I grow really like. Like not really big, but say my channel grows, and it's a pretty decent channel. I'll keep going, cause yeah, wouldn't want to just like go a few years and then just crap all over my f like any fans I get, cause that would just be that would just be horrible. Oh yeah, I'm planning on playing Earthbound soon on my channel. Uh, I need to get it uh, downloaded first. Like I've got it on a. Uh, I can't remember what the cons was, but the cons was a few games on it, just so you know I have it, but I'm going to be playing it on an emulator, because uh, I can't really record on the console, but I do own the game, so don't bust my balls for that, I do own the game. I also might play RuneScape on my channel at some point, don't know when that'll be though.
Oh, we got a jungle. I need to start collecting melons now because I do plan on making a what is it called again? A valley of melons. I know it's been done before, but I want to make one too. I'm also going to be making a valley of furnaces at the world border. Yes, I know it's been done, but again, I really want to make one myself. Valley of furnaces was the first, uh, like you know, proper like uh, you know, landmark on 2B2T that I found. So, yeah, I'd like to honour it by making another one. I hope that furnaces stack, because if they don't, it's going to be a long time I'm going to be building the Valley of Furnaces. I don't find any melons yet, what's going on? I need melons. Damn parrots. I won't kill the parrots, don't worry. I know I kill like everything on this server, but no, I won't kill the parrots. Parrots are kind of cool. I tamed one once and uh, I thought it would like follow me forever. And I thought it could like uh, make it so you fall slower if they go on your like, you know, like shoulders, like if you get two of them on your shoulders, but I don't think they do. That would be nice if it made you fall slower. Come on, where's the melons at? Oh, there we go, there's some melons. Give me. We need to make the Valley of Melons. Reason being, everyone needs an oasis. Gonna need to start collecting bones soon. Gonna need some bones to get a bloody bone meal. Bone meal is easy to get anyway. Should be able to get like tons of it. Might even make a melon house. But that will be difficult to make. I don't actually know how to do that. I'll find it. Wait. Hold on a second. Ah yeah. Right. I can easily make a melon house. Right, let's just place this. Uh, where's my shovel? Got 13 of them. Is that all the melons we're getting? Come on, there has to be a wee bit more. No? Aww. Holy shit. Uh, melon seeds. Let's wait, what's the TPS? Alright, I'm gonna be careful. Put the melon seeds in there. There we go. I need to repair the sword as well at some point. Let's go uh, this way. Oh look, the jungle continues. Might be more melons. Everyone loves melons. It's a very beloved food on 2B2T. It feels so good like going through a, a jungle when the TPS isn't horrible. Like soon the TPS is at like 6, oh my god, see going for a jungle is the most difficult thing ever. 
because you have to constantly jump over bits and then you get stuck in areas, it's just annoying. Right, let's go. And the reason I put it in third person when I'm going uh, across the water is because like I need to make sure I'm not like gonna walk over the edge and it's harder to see it in first person. I need to try and like sometimes I need to try and stop when I Oh god damn it. Yeah, now you know why I go in third person. <laughs> I wonder what my cat's doing, she's usually in my room, but I don't know, she's just like, stoting about her now. Come on. It's a good thing it's night time. See, night time, that's the best time to use frost walking because your ice doesn't melt. Like, see when your ice is melting? Oh, it's horrible because, like, well, it's melting, so, like, you're gonna, if you get stuck and, like, say, the ice all melts around you and you fall in the water, you're screwed. Oh, yeah, I'll have another tutorial video up today. Uh, this one will just be about how to get started on 2B2T. Basically, basic stuff. And no, you don't need hacks to get started in 2v2t. I never used hacks at the start. I, I escaped spawn without using any hacks. It was difficult, but I was able to do it. But I'll tell you how to do it in the tutorial video. Come on. <laughs> Has anyone in the comments ever seen Tiger King? See if you haven't seen Tiger King, you need to watch Tiger King. Tiger King is the funniest thing you'll ever watch in your life. Like, it's a documentary, but it is one hell of a funny documentary. Like, you will love it. One minute, my friend's messaging me. I don't know why people always message me when I'm recording. Oh well. Wait, what time we at? 14 minutes? We're gonna go 20 minutes this time. And it looked like my recording software was stuck at the start of the bloody uh, time I started playing this, so I'm hoping my video actually records properly. Because I've had it where now my videos is not recorded properly, it's been bloody annoying. And I've just realised I've not equipped my shovel. Which is nearly broken. I'll fix it. That, that's a problem for future Kyle to fix. Yes, my real name's Kyle. But my online nickname has always been Larry. 
I might tell you the story of how I made up the Larry meme at some point. That's a kind of cool story. How I like to say started uh, loving Larry as my favourite character in gaming history. That'd be a nice story to tell at some point. Oh yeah, on Halloween I'm probably going to play a horror game on my channel. Like, don't know what one yet, I'm going to play something scary. Might play Darkwood, don't know. I actually need to continue playing that game. I did say I was going to finish it on the channel. I'll play it at some point, don't worry. Like, see if I stop playing a game for a while. Don't think I've stopped playing it, like, I've probably just forgotten about it, but I'll play it eventually. Same with Adventure Quest, that will be coming back as well. I just keep forgetting to play it. I'm just looking at my phone. There we go. Just had to send a message to someone. Alright, let's jump on top of this cactus. We can do it. Oh, uh, it didn't even. I want to show you guys something actually. There's a way to do like a, a really high jump. So, what you do is you jump on something and you jump just before you take damage. Look at that. See, I jumped really high there. I even took some fall damage. Look. Oh, I messed it up. Like, you can do a, like a triple jump. Like, jump like three or four blocks high with this. If you'd get it right on that. Do it in first person, it's easier to do in first person. It's harder to do with it, see if the TPS is like uh, high, it's harder to do, but see low TPS, you can do this well easy. What? I didn't even take damage from it there! Yeah, it's not going to work with a high TPS. Yeah, it's not going to work. But basically what you can do is sometimes you can make it so you jump really high and it's pretty cool. You can use it to get to higher places. Like it's not just for cactuses it works, it works with any damage. Like if you jump just before you're about to take damage, it will make sometimes make you bounce really high. It's pretty cool. Works best on low TPS though because uh, in high TPS sometimes it just sends you down like that. Look. Oh look, see that? I jumped a lot farther. Look at that. Got it. Yep, I even took fall damage there. That's how good it is. It's a pretty good wee trick. I use it sometimes. Right, I'm going to do one last thing and then I'm going to end the video. Ah, I want to jump really high on that. I want to try this. I need to... Yes! Look at that! I just love doing that. Well, if you enjoyed the video, please like, comment and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. May Larry's big, bulging, greasy chin be with you always. Peace.